Washington and Beijing are sending mixed signals about the direction of their trade negotiations. President Trump is sounding confident but adding pressure. And analysts say China wants to move ahead but also won't cave in. Kordio Ni reports. With the leaders of the U.S. and China to meet later this month at the G20 summit in Japan, the two countries are sending signals both positive and negative. Speaking to reporters on Thursday, researcher Liang Ming, who works at a think tank under Beijing's Commerce Ministry, said China wants good results from the meeting. He said there's a high possibility that the two leaders will reach an agreement there, but he emphasized that China won't take further steps in the negotiations unless the U.S. shows sincerity. President Trump, meanwhile, said on Wednesday that he has a feeling there will be a trade deal with Beijing. Speaking to reporters at the White House, Trump said the two countries have a good relationship, although it has become a little bit testy recently over tariffs. Asked about the deadline for imposing tariffs on an additional $325 billion worth of Chinese goods, he said there is none. I have no deadline. I'll, my deadline is what's up here. We'll figure out the deadline. Okay. Nobody can quite figure it out. No deadline, but he said more tariffs will be imposed if negotiations break down. Those would be levies on nearly all of the Chinese imports not already subject to them, including cell phones and clothing. Since last year, the world's biggest economies have put tariffs on around 360 billion U.S. dollars worth of each other's goods. And the tensions have been escalating since they recently raised some existing tariffs. Since their trade negotiations ended in May without a deal, Washington and Beijing have been blaming each other for the talks collapse. Kuruni, Arirang News.